Boxing Ego here. If you like this video, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon on the top of your screen to get notified when the latest new content drops. One. Angel Garcia claims that Keith one time Thurman was stripped of his WBC title. He didn't vacate. Stay tuned. People, ladies and gentlemen, the reason I'm dressed like this with a crown and WBC buckle because this buckle belongs here in this crib. Okay, I want people to understand that Thurman, they stripped him out the WBC. He didn't vacate the belt. Okay, they stripped him, but if he would have vacated the belt, he would have vacated the WBA. So the politics, this baby belongs here. So Porter, what could you wish for? So everything gotta be right though for the fight to happen. So Porter, what did you wish for? And another thing is, People that we gonna do doping, the WBC doping. So Thurman, he got stripped, not the vacate, nothing, stripped. See you on the end of the summer. What up, fight world? It's your boy Ego, and I'm back with some more boxing. Make sure you smash the like button, also subscribe to the channel for the latest and greatest in boxing. If you want to become part of the gang, gang notification gang please hit the bell icon shout out to the super chats channel donations the venmo donations and the patreon family we work in now you guys know where you're here first keep it locked thank you for the subscribers and we just hit over 100 million views channel lifetime i appreciate you guys angel garcia he had a king crown he had a wbc belt a belt his son had at welterweight had at 140 and he claims that Keith Thurman was actually removed of his belt. He was stripped. Stripped. He even was playing around and stuff like that and said it like that. He said he got stripped. I just want to see you strip. Chris Brown voice. And he says he didn't vacate. He said because if he was vacating because of the injury, as he claims, why didn't he vacate the second belt, the WBA belt? Right? Why would he only vacate one? So he's claiming the WBC stripped him now i did say this on my live stream i did earlier talking about this subject i think it was like a richard nixon it's either you resign or you're gonna get impeached i think it's probably something like that keith thurman knew his time with the injuries and you know what i mean the derrick rose back-to-back -back injuries and not fighting in may he knew that if he held on to the belt he would have to he would get stripped and that's He'd rather do it on his own accord, just like Tyson Fury. Tyson Fury failed the drug test after beating Klitschko. They were supposed to rematch, failed the drug test, it was revealed. So he relinquished his belts because if he didn't relinquish his belts, then he would be stripped. So I think it's a similar situation with Keith Thurman. It's just, um, it has nothing to do with cocaine. It has something to do with his injury, being injury prone. Um, he also said in that video, as you guys seen, Sean Porter, you're going to get what you ask asking for, but the deal has to be right. The money has to be right. And they want doping. He says the WBC belt belongs with Danny Garcia. And I want to know what you guys think. My thoughts are very simple. Angel Garcia is a character. He's, he adds entertainment value to the fights. I think him and Kenny Porter would be an awesome battle of wits or minds or quotables whatever you want to call it um if porter and danny garcia fight and i'm glad keith thurman vacated his belt because he's not fighting you know what i mean so why hold up and stall out the division and prolong it and then wait till they strip you and then three four months have passed by the time they actually the date they can actually strip you and now they can't start negotiating so the the two highest ranked wbc guys are sean porter and danny swift garcia so that being said this creates an avenue for them to start the negotiating process now so we can see that fight asap the wbc did reveal that keith thurman once he comes back once he's back healthy then he'll be eligible to fight for the belt you know what i mean because no one beat him in the ring just kind of like tyson fury no one beat him in the ring still undefeated let me know what you guys think angel garcia definitely entertaining and do you believe him that keith thurman was stripped like I said, me, I think it was an issue of if he didn't vacate or relinquish his belt, he would have been stripped. And I think he knew that. He probably had, him and his team probably had cor correspondence with the WBC and they knew they had to fight somebody. And the WBC was lenient. They're going to allow him to, 
not face a mandatory first because he was injured but then when he pulled out of that may fight it probably got to the point where it's like we can't just let you keep holding on to the title you know what i mean the wbc is an organization people respect we got to follow protocol so hopefully they follow protocol also with gennady golovkin and the fight with jamal charlo he is now after beating hugo centeno i believe he's the number one ranked mandatory so after you're going to allow for canelo versus golovkin to rematch it's a big fight money fight cool but after the winner of that needs to fight jamal charlo let me know what you guys think of angel garcia's rant drop it in the comment section make sure you smash the like button as always hate comment and subscribe till next video is ego signing off